the Select Board Water Commissioner meeting uh, October 11th of 2021. I'll read tonight's agenda. Under new business, we need to sign some warrants. We need to approve uh, previous meeting minutes. So we got a fleet permit to sign, a water agreement to sign. We will go into executive session at the end of the meeting to speak on some personnel stuff. Um, under old business, we need to review the class 4 roads and trails for ATV use. Anything else that needs to go on the agenda for tonight? No, sir. Alright, we'll get started then. We'll get ready to jump right into these uh, warrants and permits. submitted one to the insurance. That was one a quote Seth got for the stop sign yep. on Roy's Corner. Oh, on Roy's Corner. This isn't the work that he did on Russell Road. Okay. That one came in at 6500 It's not in there yet. Yeah. Okay. But that one was submitted to the insurance. That guy's insurance. Perfect. So this is a quote to put a sign up. Do we have to get uh, the okay from the state on a sign like this because it's on, on their intersection? I don't think so because it'll be on the town road. It'll be the town roads that are you have the stop signs, not the highway. But I think it has to be so many feet before the actual before stop the sign. the actual stop sign. So it's a 12 inch solar red beacon flashing 24-7. Got a yellow housing with a black door and visor. Cabinet bracket fits around holes. It's got a 30 watt solar panel package. It mounts on the top of the pole. It's got a battery. A 30 by 30 stop ahead sign. And then the pole. Mounting kit, freight and labor, concrete base provided by others. Must be Seth would just go down and mix up some concrete, dump it in there. Fifty-five hundred dollars. Where is that going to be? On Roy's corner. I know we had talked about it. Coming off of Woods Hill Road right yes. now to make sure. Of. Now is there, there must be, um, there must be some um, requirement of how far signs. back from the stop sign that goes. I think those are state signs. Not our stop signs. I believe so. On our roads? On the, in the state intersection. Because we're entering the state road. But this would be a stop ahead. Oh. We'll be back. Yep. How far back do, does it say on there? I don't know. It says that, but that is state that have to be specified how yeah, many probably. feet from the stop sign it has to be. I'm sure Seth can figure that out, right? And just kind of ask him. Somebody request this? Or? Well, we had talked about it a few 
It's been talked about for quite a few years yeah. there. And then the, uh, the, 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 the last time stuff was in here, I asked him about that to get a price to see what it would be because he had the guys doing the, fixing the sign at the end of Russell Road. I said, well, ask him what it would be to put a flashing light because that always is a spot where we have people flying. Yeah. You know, they don't, you know, yeah, they have the signs that say stop ahead, but a light might. Actually, May slow them down. No, there was a the sign on the Russell Road's fixed, and there was an accident there the other day. The first thing I said, did they hit the sign? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> said, no, they did hit the sign, but it. Someone coming saw. off Russell, or is it obviously yeah. one way or the other? Out. Was it not working? Oh, it was working. Because the car behind it said it was flashing. But there was a tractor went by, and so I don't know why they, they were in a rush to get out. They wanted to pass that tractor, I guess, or something, and a freaking truck T boned them. Oh. Hmm. A little car again. Nobody got hurt too bad, I guess. But. All right, I'll read the meeting minutes from the previous meeting. It was a uh, select board water commissioner meeting. Uh, from September 27th of 2021, present with Stephen Dodd, Seth Hungerford, Nicholas Norris, David Plubit, Joe Dunlevy, Kim Dufresne. 7.40, I called the meeting to order and read the agenda. We signed warrants 2136 and 2137. Read meeting minutes from September 13th meeting. Amendment was made to add Jamie Whitehead present for executive meeting. Uh, Seth motion to accept, seconded by Joe and all in favor. <clears throat> I spoke with Seth Cattell, who was unable to attend the meeting about the overhead door quote for the garage. He reported the doors would be available for installation the later part of October, and we approved the door quote. Uh, traffic light for Russell Road is going to be installed that week, and they repaired the 2018 truck exhaust. Guardrails on Main Street were still on schedule to be replaced in October, and he was working on winter salt quotes. Uh, we discussed extending the town water line further on Crow Hill. The cost to do this would be at the homeowner's expense. Um, that's changed. Anyways, uh, we approved records requests from Cisco Hydro. For invoices paid for legal and appraisal fees under advice from the town's attorney. Uh, we tabled the ATV use on class four and trails till further. Uh, eight o'clock, Nick motioned to go into executive session, seconded by Joe. At 8.30, we exited executive session, reviewed highway employment applications, and uh, 8.30, we Motion to adjourn and seconded by David. Uh, meeting adjourned. Uh, take a motion to accept these minutes as read. I'll make a motion. I second it. All right, all in favor? Aye. Aye.
look at those roads and trails. So. I did, um, but I, when I redid my kitchen or I moved in my kitchen, oh. I'm not quite sure where that map got put because I did do a nice little. Did some highlighting and some yeah, tape it. Yeah, well, it's, it's probably, yeah, the dishwasher or in the stove or uh, could be in my garage or it could be in the bedroom where some of the stuff is. I'm not quite sure where I located that too, so probably better for me to get a new one and do yeah. it again. But yes, I did. Right. Yes, where it got put is not quite at my fingertips right now. Are you are we like exploring the idea of opening a few of those trails or? I just was trying to identify them all. Yeah. And that, that way we could, we weren't trying to sit around the table and look at this one, this one, this one, or this one, this one, this one, or just. That's all. Do we have a fall cleanup in Jordan's? Yeah. We do. Uh, for which area? For the cemeteries we did, right? Not for the cemeteries. Just, for, cemeteries just, just where for the park and the ball field, I believe. The park ball field. See, they're playing baseball down there the other day. Right? This time of year. Fall ball that goes until it went went till this past weekend. Mm -hmm. What age is that? Like a little bit? Yeah. 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 Good. Good to see somebody using the field. Cheap is it? I know the, the state of Vermont had looked at that intersection being one of the dangerous 
section is kind of like on the Russell Road. I wonder if there might be a grant that we could also get for that area. We have a, have a TAC meeting on Thursday and we're reviewing projects for next year. I can put this on our agenda of like things that we're concerned about and spots we're concerned about and see if we can get, you know, because I know uh, Franklin, they just put the no road where that, where that funky at the end of, we go out of, oh, the yeah, the way that we're, that we're, that we're, that we're like, yeah, the six different ways where you're coming up into it like this. But you can y yield this way and turn this way, and then, yeah, they're looking at that whole intersection because it's like it's bad no matter which way you come there. Put a roundabout in there. It's freaking out. They've been putting a lot of those in there. They have. I'm, I'm a fan of them. Jeffersonville there. Yeah, yeah over there. Yeah, there's, there's a couple there's of them. There's three of them. I, I I like them. I, think. I, I don't mind them either. I think they're you go they're better than sitting there waiting for ten minutes to try to get out. More Ireland, there's one every five kilometers, and you go the wrong way. They're three lanes wide. That's fine. Yeah, when you go to Maine, they're everywhere. Everywhere. It's like, I keeps the full traffic going. You're not slowing down. Not it slows them down. Slows them down, and it you know. You know, keeps it going through at the same time. You get those intersections where one one road goes straight through and the other two have you know stopped or that's where they get accidents because they pull out. They got Nobody's in a hurry. They got their corner. That's just, I mean even still now mm -hmm. you get where you can drive through but yet you can yield to go left. You have to yield to go left when it's on. It's like. I can ask about this. All right, that and the intersection. I wonder so. how much traffic's mm -hmm. picked up now that we've paid Macy Road. If, if a lot of people, well, there's a lot of people that took it as soon as they fixed the bridge there to, yeah. to get to, you know, to mountains and coming down off Race Hill or just shoot across 78, stay up on the five in the morning. For how many people took up Woods Hill now that we that we paid that yeah, 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 yeah too. We're going Woods Hill, yeah. Jumping on the interstate over there or whatever. Well, yeah. in my past one 105, they go Woods Hill, Bushy Road. You, you can find that one slow car or tractor trip. School bus. School bus on 105. It's, it's over. No place where they pass safely. Mm -hmm. Well, sometimes go and down my road and come down pond, go back to the ends to get on the interstate. Because instead of going the other way, it's mm -hmm. get caught in that traffic down there. Or three lights that you might get intercepted on. Well, I've covered everything now. I just, I just got so much. I think so. I think so. All right, I'll take a motion to go into executive session. I'll make a motion to go to executive session, and when we're done, we'll uh, end the meeting. All right. I'll second it. Okay. All in favor doing that?